More and more businesses in Taiwan have felt the impact of the nation's declining birth rate as youth employment rates in the labor market continue to drop. Although there are many vacancies in the job market, young adults nowadays prefer more flexible work schedules and environments. However, this type of working mode is not prevalent among manufacturing or more traditional industries, meaning young adults will be less likely to seek employment there, creating a huge gap in the labor force. I think the 职业选择很多元，就是像我自己可能，因为我是做行销出身的，所以我在呃可能没有工作的时候，我也可以做接案。然后现在有很多人也其实也会经营，就是针对自己有兴趣的主题去经营自媒体。According to the Ministry of Labor, the number of people aged between 15 and 29 in the workforce was 2.48 million in 2010. However, this dropped to just 2.32 million in 2021, around 160,000 fewer people. Experts expect the situation to get even worse in the future. 年轻员工，既然我们不容易找到，当然也跟生育率有关，也跟全球化的竞争有关。其实你应该把你的工作流程可以标准化，因为今天一旦你的工作流程可以标准化，你会去降低到说你对特定人才的依赖性。According to a recent survey by a local job bank, 65% of businesses in Taiwan suffer from labor shortage issues today. From the food service industry to the semiconductor industries, job vacancy rates will likely become an even bigger problem to address in the future. Liu Yanxuan, Zhong Derong, Vivian Xiao, TVBS World Taiwan.